it's that time of year again. Henley Row Regatta. Do you feel it? Finals of Henley Raw Regatta, and today is actually our first day of racing. I'm really looking forward to it. I think we're on at uh, 3:50. I keep my feet up resting because it's so late in the day. You don't want to be walking around. You want to rest as much as you can. You want to keep your feet up. So I'm actually in the Leander Club. They're very kindly let me use their facilities. They feed us. They water us. They look after us during the Henley time. Don't get me wrong. I love the uh, the tents and the enclosures and coming in and out of there and the believe it or not the freezing cold showers. Uh, but you know it's a bit more calm here it's, you can actually there's nice comfy chairs you can sit on you're not rushed for time you don't feel so sort of claustrophobic with all the other athletes everywhere and yeah it's just a nice time to sort of switch off and chill out So I've just got home, uh, it's been a very long day. It's been a very good day, successful day, uh, but we had our pre-paddle at seven o'clock this morning. It is now seven, 7.30 in the evening. Um, our race was at four, so there's a lot of sitting around from when we got off the water at, I think we got off the water about eight. So, you know, there's a, there's a lot of waiting around, you know, at least seven hours of just trying to not think about rowing, not think about racing. I let myself watch a bit of racing and maybe the two hours leading into my own race, it helps me. It gets me pumped up to see all the other close racing and seeing everyone sort of having these humdingers where, you know, the outcome is decided by two feet over such a long distance. Um, but our race is at four o'clock and if you saw it, you may have seen that we had a little bit of steering uh, issues out of the blocks, but I think we recovered well from that. We found our legs through the middle, and that's where we did the damage. Um, you know, we won by a good margin, and um, you know, got massive respect for the South Africans. I've had the honour and the privilege of racing against the majority over of that crew throughout my current rowing career, and they're hard guys. They never give up. They never give in. Um, the World Championships is a long way away. Um, so that's primarily what we're focusing on and just like the World Cups, just like the Europeans, Henley is another stepping stone for us to try new things out, see what works for us. I think the combination so far is working well um, and yeah, I mean the day's getting on so I'm going to put my feet up, I'm going to have some food and tomorrow we race the Italians. I've just looked at the um, timetable and we're actually going to be racing at about one o'clock so that should be the last race before lunch and I'm really looking forward to that. The Italian, they beat us by a good clear margin at the Europeans and um, I think it's about time we got our own back. 